Good morning, Palisades. I am Carly, and today is Tuesday, November 10th, day four. Please rise for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Hi, I'm Paige. And I'm Haley. With your school announcements. Report cards will be available on November 15th. Parent-teacher conferences will take place virtually on Tuesday, November 24th. If you are interested in joining Debate Club, please reach out to Mrs. Hornberger. This year for debate, there will be many fun topics and virtual competitions taking place. Also, please reach out to Mrs. Hornberger if you are interested in reading Olympics. The team currently does not have enough members to participate in the virtual competitions as of right now. The Scholars Bowl Club will be having its first official meeting today after school in room 103 and online. If you are not a member and are interested in joining, you are welcome to come to the meeting and find out what this is all about. If you have any questions, please contact Mrs. Lipton or Mrs. Wright. Congratulations to this year's French Club officers. President Honey Smith, Vice President Addie Russell, Secretary Lucia Brunton, and Treasurer Ali Winskowski. Attention juniors and seniors, please visit the online guidance calendar, which has virtual college visits and scholarship information posted. Next is Addie and Carly with the national news. I'm Carly. And I'm Addie. And we are here with the national news. Joe Biden has had plenty of congratulations from leaders across the world for his win in the 2020 election, but many influential leaders have yet to congratulate Biden and Kamala. The leaders of Russia, China, and Turkey have not yet acknowledged Biden as the elected leader. This may be due to Biden's policies with these foreign countries. Now on to Cameron with the entertainment news. Hi, I'm Cameron with your entertainment news. On Saturday, Jeopardy host Alex Trebek passed away at 80. He was battling stage 4 pancreatic cancer. He started hosting the show in 1984 and he hosted every show since then except for one on April Fool's Day in 1997. Next is Galen with the sports results. Right. I'm Galen. And I'm Bale with the sports results for today. On Saturday, Thomas Bingo placed third in states for the PIAA cross country meet. The girls soccer team lost a tough battle against Allentown Central Catholic with a score of 1-0 on Saturday evening. The girls worked very hard this year and had a great season. <laughs> also on Saturday, the football team won 70-6 against Panther Valley in the quarterfinals. Now on to Baylor with the upcoming sports. Hi, good morning Palisades. I'm Baylor with the upcoming sports. Saturday, the football team will have a home game against Cass Aqua. This Thursday for the NFL, the Colts will be playing the Titans. Next up is Kyle with the weather. Hi, I'm Kyle with the weather. Today, Wednesday, November 12th, there's a high of 67 and a low of 59. It will be partly cloudy. Here's your five day weather forecast. <laughs> Hey you! Yeah you! Are you rocking your latest pirate gear? Show some pirate pride! Support your school store and look good while doing it. Today for lunch the options are hamburger, pizza rolls, corn dogs, and chicken tenders. Don't forget to put your ear in. Have a great day, Patsy.